family pride to play for as long since relegated Angers hosted more recently relegated Troyes during this season's penultimate match day. Despite their respective drops to the second tier having been confirmed, both sides surely determined to end their winless runs before the end of the season. They've managed just one win each in 2023, go ending a record-breaking winless run six games ago. Whilst Estac are now without a victory since the start of January. Patrick is Norbo's second game in charge. It's been a head-scratching kind of a time. This, with respect to both sides, about as good a chance as they've had to pick up three points towards the end of the campaign. It's visitors who put themselves on the path to ending their unwanted run. Xavier Chevalerin beautifully guiding home a half volley with his left foot. Yes, Larucci with the ball in from the left. His first ever Liga Ubrich's assist. Home fans have to be patient as their side attempted to test Matthias Luz. Took until half hour mark for the Southampton Loney to be called into action. The acrobatically diverted Batista Mendy's long range drive away from goal. Nice strike, but it would be an even better one that did get them back on level terms. Half time on the horizon. Moments after having been denied a penalty, Imad Abdeli unleashed a half volley even more impressive than the one at the other end. Crashed in off the underside of the bar. Ball from outside the box in two consecutive games. First time an Andre player has managed that since Rashid Aliui in 2019. It's back to square one at the halfway point. Hoping to make it a league double following a 3-1 victory in August's reverse fixture. Kisnorbo caught upon the services of Mama Balde on the bench for the second half. Estac's top scorer having been forced to sit out last weekend's draw with Strasbourg through suspension. The change didn't have the desired effect as the host came close to completing the turnaround. First Abdallah Sima striking the outright after having been put through very nicely by Mendy. And then within the space of two minutes... The woodwork rattling again as Liz did well to turn Pierrick Capel's effort onto the post. It remained one way traffic from the resulting corner. Mia Blazic producing another good save from the Polish keeper. Down quickly. Fight, Blazic rising highest. A double change from Alexandre Dujou late on. Lilian Rao Lisoa and Farid El Melali introduced. After having watched his side throw the kitchen sink at the Tour goal for the majority of the second half, it will be the former who finally found the breakthrough in the 90th minute. Initially kept alive by Capel and Rao Lisoa curling an exquisite strike past Liz into the top corner. Three beautiful goals to remind onlookers that these two sides can certainly play some nice football, even if they'll be doing so in the second division next season. Muted celebrations at the full-time whistle. But a consolation for Angers as they at least move to within five points of Troyes, whose winless streak goes on.